hi guys welcome to another video by new tech text tv in this video i'm going to show you how you can solve uh, this error when when i open when i try to open eclipse then it shows me that the jre and or the jdk is not uh, available for eclipse and uh, so basically we need to set the path of the jvm so currently as you can see it is uh, c program files java slash jdk and this is the version so if i go to this path let me open one i'll go to i'll press windows key and the r key and now if i type c colon program files slash java and now if you see the version which is present uh, here in my C drive it is different than the one which is shown in this uh, dialog box so I will change this I will first uh, copy it and click on the OK button to close that uh, pop up and now I will open the Eclipse INI, 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 INI file and I will edit it so once you edit click on edit then this uh, file will be opened in notepad and uh, if this file doesn't open in notepad then what you can do is you can just right click on this and open with then you can go with the notepad option so next there's a line called uh, hyphen vm which is virtual machine so as you can see the this path is incorrect because this path is not present in the program files so i will delete this and paste the path with the slash bin now if i save this file and close it and next if i double click on eclipse id and boom it, it will start working so that's how you uh, configure the virtual machine in for eclipse so let us wait for it to completely start it will take some time generally during the first time it takes uh, a bit more so as you can see it is showing the starting eclipse ide so make sure that you have Java installed on your uh, machine. If you want to know uh, how to install Java on your Windows 10 machine, you can you can leave a comment, and I will make another video on the same topic. The Eclipse ID is open, and uh, we can see the projects on my in the Package Explorer. So that's all for this video. If you have any questions, you can ask in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel New Tech Tricks TV. Thanks for watching.